And now you're going to underline the correct tense. The correct tense. Okay, the sentence is correct. But you have to choose which tense is correct. Simple past or present perfect. So read the sentences. If you want, you can help you with the text that you have here. Make a pause and choose the correct. Then we are going to compare your answers. Ready? Okay, let's see. Mr. Cecil managed, no, has managed Biltmore House since 1976. Quiere decir que hasta hoy lo sigue manejando. His mother died in 1976. Murió, no, no puede decir has died. The Van Birdville family has owned the house for over 115 years. Quiere decir que Sigue siendo dueña de esa casa. In 2010, around 1 million people visited the house. Porque se está refiriendo exactamente al 2010. The original owner didn't build the state. ¿Por qué? Porque está, eh, dice no construyó en el pasado. Ya está construida la casa. No puede decir ha construido. And in has been on state for 14 years. Un hospedaje ha estado... Por 14 años. Quiere decir que hasta ahora sigue funcionando. Now here. What do you think? Are there houses like build more house in your country here in Peru? So you answer this. Who owns them? For example, Basadre's house. Well, well, this is not like this, no? but an answer. Is there an upper class in your country? What kinds of school do they go to? What kind of professions do they often have? What kinds of pastimes do they like? Sorry, pastimes do they like? Is it where so much wealth can be inherited? So you're going to answer these questions. When you finish this, take a picture of yes, not at all this, just this page. Because I want to see your answers. For this part, this part, and this part. Okay, in your picture, I want to see this. Now we go to your workbooks. Please open your workbooks. 